iDevices wall outlet has been designed to make it simple and quick to get set up. In a few short steps, you'll transform your wall outlet into a connected wall outlet. In the box, you will find the iDevices wall outlet installation guide, as well as a few wire nuts to help with your installation. To install, you will need a flathead screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, a voltage detector, and pliers. The iDevices wall outlet fits any standard size rocker faceplate, so you can select one that works best for your home. If the wires in your gang box differ from the installation described in this video, or you are unclear at any point of the installation process, please consult a qualified, licensed electrician. iDevices wall outlet must be installed in a manner that conforms to all applicable national, state, and local building codes. Turn off the power to the circuit at your breaker or fuse panel. If you are replacing an existing outlet, verify that the outlet no longer has power before proceeding, using a voltage detector. Now, unscrew and remove the faceplate from the existing outlet. Next, remove the two screws that secure the outlet to the gang box. Carefully pull on the outlet to remove it from the gang box. Take a photo of your existing wiring for future reference. Disconnect your old wall outlet by unscrewing and removing the existing wires. Wherever possible, install the iDevices wall outlet in a non-metallic gang box and use a non-metallic faceplate as metal gang boxes and faceplates can decrease the Wi-Fi signal strength. When installing the iDevices wall outlet, connect the black wire on the back of the wall outlet to the line wires, which are typically black, with the provided wire nuts. If there are multiple black wires, cap them all together. Next, connect the white wire on the iDevices wall outlet to the neutral wires, which are usually white, with the provided wire nuts. If there are multiple white wires, cap them all together. Lastly, connect the bare copper ground wire on the iDevices wall outlet to the ground wire, which is usually copper or green in color. Ensure all wire nuts are securely fastened. Carefully push the wires into the gang box and install the wall outlet into the gang box, taking care not to pinch any wires. Secure the iDevices wall outlet into the gang box with the provided screws. It's best to start both screws before tightening to keep installation easy and ensure the outlet is straight. You can now install your selected faceplate. The iDevices wall outlet fits any standard size rocker faceplate, so you can select one that works best for your home. Turn the power back on at the breaker. If the outlet is connected properly, you should see the LED indicator rapidly flash blue to indicate the unit is ready to connect to the app. Launch the iDevices Connected app and you will be guided through the process of connecting your iDevices product. For iOS devices, you will need the HomeKit setup code on the pull-out tab on your product. Congratulations! Your wall outlet is installed. You're now ready to connect to your wireless network. If you want to learn more about iDevices Outlet or need additional help, head over to iDevicesInc.com support.